In this video, we're going to demonstrate the head hold and a transition grip. If your patient has a suspected spinal injury, then you'll need to support their spine for protection and pain relief. You can use these two very basic grips to maintain spinal motion restriction. So the first is a simple head hold. To do this, you want to put one hand on either side of the patient's head. Make sure that your elbows are supported by your legs. An alternative to that is that your hands can be supported by the ground. So you would lie down like this and hold the head. Now what we'll show you is a transition grip. So Quinn's gonna come in. She's gonna put one arm down the patient's sternum and hold onto the patient's face. She's then going to take her top arm, place it on top of the patient's forehead, and when she's got her, she's going to tell her that we're secure. Secure. Mm -hmm. I'm going to let go. And now I can get into a different position. I can take hold of the head, and when I've got her, I'll just tell to Quinn. Good. You can let go. And that's a head hold and transition grip. So that's it for the head hold and transition grip. Use it to keep your patient's neck still and to reduce their pain.